shiny mail. Everybody look, it's shiny mail. I'm gonna disappear into darkness now. <laughs> We're getting ready for Emily's birthday party. So we had to make some photo props. I'm gonna do a photo day. It's in three days, I believe, right? Something like that. So we have a haul, as you can see. Lots of paintings to share with you today. I am, um... Okay, so we'll just jump right in. You want to do your favorite one? I'll let you do your favorite one. Where is it? There it is. How dare you put it at the bottom? Come on over here. The first one is what I'm going to be doing. It's a unicorn. Sticking his tongue out. He's like, Bleh! pretty much. Derp. <laughs> he's a derp. Uh, let's see. And he's in Galaxy 2. I love Galaxy and Unicorn. Alright, so let's find. Here's the drills for this guy. Say bye. I'm going to go play Roblox now. Alright, so the kit is the standard. Got a few bags in there. And the, again, the painting. It's literally just a unicorn, so no background, no horn. It's weird. A few of them go up the horn. It's kind of strange, but I knew she would like it because she's like unicorn crazy right now. So let's tilt you down, move you over. And these, this packaging is different. I haven't seen this type of packaging. I can get it open. Ugh. Everything is printed nice and clear. Uh, no DMC codes, but it's all purple and pink and purple and a little bit of blue and this is like a navy blue and black. They, they're really close. Well, on camera you can tell the difference. So navy blue and black. So that is that cute little dude. These, again, are all from eBay. They are still trickling in from eBay. My list is getting shorter and shorter of what I'm still waiting on. I've only been disappointed twice, like thoroughly disappointed twice so far with this huge eBay purchase. Um, if you remember... If you've been here from the beginning, if not, go back and watch the other videos. Um, I had two paintings. One came soaking wet, um, and it was a partial. It was supposed to be a full. Never got a replacement on that. Never got a refund, nothing. Um, and the other one was supposed to have been a full, and it came as a partial. And again, never got a replacement, never got a refund. But you live and you learn. Still got the paintings. Um, the one that was all wet did dry out okay. Um, I haven't looked at it recently, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be all right and I can do it. I'm just annoyed that it's a partial when it was supposed to be a full. So what are you going to do? Uh, let's see. The next is another partial. And again, I've said in other videos, I don't mind partials that are like this when the background is a solid color because I think it really makes it pop out a lot better. So this is kind of a rainbow. He's more, much more rainbow in the listing. But this, it has 27 colors, which is quite a lot. And he is, his drills are, I thought I kept these in order, but clearly I did not. Hmm. Houston, we have a problem. Well, good grief. Time out. Come back. I found them. Okay. There are a lot of numbers, like, written. It's got ZWM2642-2-1. And on the painting, it just says M264-2. 
So it kind of threw me off. I was confused. So again, this is Mr. Tiger. Tigers are another one of my favorite animals. I, have, I love all animals. Um, tigers, owls, uh, cats. My dream before I matured and realized what a bad idea it was, was to own a Bengal tiger, a white Bengal tiger to be exact. And I even found a, um, what do you call that? Like a refuge place that was not far from where I grew up and they let me come and visit and um, I wanted to work for them. But of course, by the time I was old enough to go work for them, they were no longer, um, the animals were still there, but I guess they weren't, they didn't pay employees that something of that sort. Maybe it was just a volunteer. I don't quite remember, but yeah, I've only been graduated for Yikes, almost 20 years. Good grief. Okay, so these are my favorite packaging, as I've said many times. It has the um, DMC code, the canvas code, and the canvas um, ID number. So again, this is pretty much ra rainbow range. Let's see, let's move it down just a little bit more. Get a little bit closer. Nope, that's not better. Okay, so we have... Touch of red, pink, brown. We have three purples. We have three blues. We have a white. One of the whites, not a white white. Navy. Some really pretty teals. I really like this one. This one's really cool. And then we have move into greens. And a green and yellow. Here's another green on this. Okay, this is a weird. Okay, whatever. So we've got cream, brown, black, another green, pink, and then yellowy orange colors. More orange than yellow. So like I said, it's full rainbow. I'm really happy. This, I mean, this is going to take me all of like, this will be just a couple hour project because it's such a small, small drill area. Same with the unicorn. Emily should be able to complete this one um, in her attention span. Um, but this one is, this is cool. This is a much better angle down here now that I see. So let's see, you get a better angle of him too. He just cracks me up with his, I should say she, I guess, whatever. Um, the tongue's sticking out. It's just like sassy little unicorn. Just like my sassy little Emily. So as I mentioned at the beginning, we're gearing up for her ninth birthday. So this is her last year in the single digits. Her birthday is September 9th. So she's nine this year. So we got all the nines going on. And, uh, she instructed me that I had to do the party favor or the photo props, the photo props. That was my, my task for today. I had to make photo props. She's got it all planned out. She's hilarious. I didn't have to do a whole lot. Okay. So the next painting I'm going to show you is kind of a disappointment. Um, I've seen this one done many times and I think it needs to be bigger. There we go. This is the part I really, really don't like. I just think that looks ridiculous. So I may just um, leave that out or make it another shade of green or brown. I'm not quite sure yet. I'll see what happens when I get there. But it is a full. And I think this is 25 by 30. Somewhere around there. Yeah, 11 and a quarter inches by seven and a half inches. Um, yeah. I do not own a centimeter roller in my house, believe it or not. Is that centimeters? Nope, that's millimeters. Inches and millimeters. Oh, well, anyway. So it's 11 and a quarter by seven and a half inches. 
So it'll work nice in an, one of the 11 by 14 frames, um, which is the size I put my cat in. But I still love it. I love the sunflowers and I love the colors of it. The colors are just out there. It's like flames. So let's tilt you back down. And I didn't pull out the drills yet. Ha 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 ha. So let's see. So Emily's birthday party is going to be unicorns. Because she is all about the unicorns right now. I forgot to show you the kit. The kit, all the kits are really standard. Um, none of them are special. They all they, look at that two, literally three Ziploc bags. It's like why bother? So two of the kits came with bags. The rest of them, oh wait, yeah, two came with bags. The rest did not. So moving on. So there's Mr. Sunflower. Really like the colors. I just I don't know. I need. I'll just have to get this in a bigger one if I don't like how it turns out. I've already got a list going of ones that I've done that I want to get in a bigger size in the future when I get some of these other ones completed. I got way too many going. So this packaging is nice and clear. No DMC codes. Um, I take that back. The DMC codes are printed on the canvas, which is cool. I like that a lot. At least they give them to you. They just are not printed on the bag, but it has the code for the canvas and the code, the item number, the serial number, they call it, for the canvas. And as you can see, these colors are awesome. Bright and vibrant and in your face. I love it. So the colors of my wedding were um, like a hunter green and a burgundy color. And this green is a little bit darker. I would say it was closer, closer to these two colors. And of course I can't. That was the colors of my wedding. <laughs> a little tidbit there. But these are packaged really nice. There's quite a few drills in these bags. These bags are full. There's a, some little rogue partiers going on there, sneaking in, having some extracurricular activities. Okay, so there's that. And the next one, we have three more. Can you believe this? This is another six painting haul and this these have come in over the past past week or so um, I've been letting them flatten out I start it with them underneath the computer and then I move them underneath my blotter um, once they get a little bit flatter this is another really really colorful one and I'll just leave the camera here instead of flipping you back and forth look how fun cows are another one of my animals one of the animals that I really love He's just so cute and so fun. I love him. So many colors. So this is a full, and I believe it's 25 by 25, which is 9 by 9. So yeah, 25 by 25 centimeters, 15 colors. And here are the drills. The last three have my favorite packaging. A little red heart border on the bottom. Okay, so again, this is another rainbow. So we have this beautiful, this is a coral, pinky coral color, really, really pretty. And we've got burgundy, some pale lavender, kind of, well, this one's more lavender. This is more pink. There's some partiers going on in there. Look at that. Party in the purple. And we've got real pretty lavender. Pretty light blue. Green apple, I call this one. Yellow. Wow, four oranges. 
So there's four different oranges, from orange-orange to burnt orange. And then we have kind of an orangey uh, beige color. This is brown. Yeah, this is brown. And then we have another apple green color in white. Yep, 5200 white. So that is the drills for this. And again, that really doesn't look like... What is my background color? Nine. Okay, so this is my background color. That really does not look like enough drills. So hopefully this is 946. Hopefully this is a color I have already. So if I need extras, I'll be able to fill it in. But worst case scenario, I scatter them um, and add another color because if you look closely, there are a few scattered here and there. Like there's some A's in with the nines. So if I don't have enough of these, it'll work that I can, you know, add in other colors to it. So I'm not, not freaking out there. I really love color number one. Where does that go? Color number one. That's the flowers scattered throughout the background. So it's going to be a really fun one. So hard. How do you decide which one to do next? I mean, like, really? I have so many that I want to do, and I can't decide which I want to do next. Okay, these last two are very similar color-wise and subject-wise, but they're really, really awesome. And when I opened these, I kind of squealed a little bit because they're really cool. They're both 30 by 40. This one, first look. Oh, my God. He's gorgeous. Isn't he awesome? He's just so light. Oh, and the colors... So pretty, look how cool he is. And it is a full, and it's 20 colors. He's just gorgeous, He's so handsome. Such a beautiful, beautiful picture. So that one is, like I said, these, these canvases are very similar color-wise, so I have to be really careful when I pull these out. So 280 and 280, yes. Okay, so here are the drills, and there are a lot. I can feel this. these packages are full. A lot heavier than the other, although it is a smaller painting session this way. This has that, that weird, <coughs> oh, why did I do that? <laughs> oh, dear God. Blah. Do not. Stick the drill package to your nose. So you can see these are stuck together. And they really, ugh, I hate the smell, but it's just the ink that, um, the ink smell, it's just gross. So moving it back. From my horrid faces, because I know I can make some crazy faces. Um, here are the really pretty, really, really pretty. Let's do this this way. So I'm not stringing the drills everywhere. You can get a better, better look at them. So again, this is pretty much rainbow. We've got that rainbow. Let's move these out of your visions. Kits out of the way. What am I going to do with all these boats? I mean, seriously, my, look at this. Ugh. Look at that. Those are all from all the kits I've gotten. And I have been only using these trays because they are the bomb. So good. The only time I use these anymore is if I have drills that are stuck together. I'll show you that in a minute. Okay, back to the subtopic at hand. Me and my little tangents. Every one of these packs that I have opened have had party packs. So there's blue and with the orange there. 
There's a blue in there that's not even in this canvas. So funny, cracks me up. So anyway, there's the colors. You can see how pretty they are. They're a little bit more muted from than the cow, but it's still absolutely beautiful. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. So this is the lion again. So pretty. I just love it. Do I say that too much? I think I love things too much. I, t I catch myself saying that all the time. Oh, I just love it. Sounds kind of hokey. I'm a hokey person, I guess. Uh, I hate when I do that. Let me go. Three. 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 Two. Okay. Moving on, we have one more to go. Oh, and y'all, we are so close to our 600 subscriber giveaway. So share it with your friends. Get me out there. And I'm trying to come up with something creative for this next giveaway. At the, um, the first giveaway that I did, the 300 mark, 300 subscriber mark, I just went through my subscriber list, and, or I, I did one through 300 on the random generator, picked that number, and then I counted down to that number. So I started with the most recent subscriber and down. So that's how I did that one. So I want to do something different with this next drawing since 600 is, that's a pretty big deal. I'm really excited. So, if you have any ideas on the drawings, let me know. Because um, I am open to suggestions, of course. So, last but not least, this is another one that I have been... This is one I've been waiting a really long time on this one. Hang on, I'm going to tell you. Um, because I feel like I ordered it really, really long ago. So, let me look it up for you. Sorry, that was Emily. Sign language in me. Okay, back to my task. Where is it? Here we go. So I will tell you, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 11 more to come. So, this painting I'm about to show you is one I ordered on my birthday. Um, the tiger. I ordered this on July 27th, and it came one day last week. Um, <laughs> Mr. Cow. was ordered on August 5th, and it came one day last week. Um, Mr. Unicorn, or Miss Unicorn, whatever you want to call her. Miss, excuse me, Emily is insisting Miss. She was ordered August 7th and came in. Um, so this just took a couple weeks. Same with the sunflower. That was paid for on August 7th as well. And then the lion was even better, August 8th. So these three came in like two weeks not even no that can't be right what is today less than a month so that's really good so like three weeks yeah um but but like i said this next one i ordered way back on my birthday july 23rd is when i paid for it so it took quite a while to get here so, without further ado, I will show you why I'm blabbering on and on. I love it. So cute. Sweet little kitty face. And it's... There's the thumbnail. Mama, it's key. It's a According to full Sophia. drill. Yeah. It's only 10 key. colors. But it's pretty cool. I like it. I wonder if we'll play Sophia. Alright, 
So the drills on this one. Hi. Again, my favorite packaging. Lots of red. I love it. Lots of black, too. That's black and two things of black. Why are there two things of black? Okay, look at this. I think I'm going to have lots of extra drills. So this down here is black. Her eye is black. This corner is black. There's scattered a black here and scattered a black here. And they gave me two bags of black. Weird. Oh, well. I've got so much extra black already as it is. It's just going to add to the stockpile. So I'll cut these apart also. All right. So these colors are a little bit, a lot more muted. Not quite rainbow, but close. No purple in this one. So we've got some cream. Look at that. There's another party bag. Look at that. There's green. There's two of them in there. One of them just went to hide. Ha, ha. There's another one. I just went to hide too. Anyway. Getting the party bags. Party, party, party. So we got some cream, some pink. Tan, blue, orange, teal, rust, orangey red, red, red. I guess that's more cherry red and more, I don't know, red, red, and then black. So that is that. Well, let's measure this this time. Three again. All right, so there are those. And again, it's that awesome packaging where it shows... The GMC code. Come on, camera. Let's go up to better light. So we have the DMC code next to the canvas code. And then down here is the serial number or the item number that shows on the painting. So what I will do is I will put these away with you all if you want to keep watching. Just to show so many new ones, if you haven't found, if you haven't gone through all of my videos yet, I would love it if you would, and give me a like, and of course subscribe, because you have a chance to win a painting. So let me go grab my containers, and um, I'll be back in a flash. Alright, I got all my stuff. This is bin number three. I have two of these that are full, and it is just how I store my drills. So these are the packages. This is why I always point out um, the number because this is my way of storing. This is the way I keep track and make things a little bit more compact. Although when you've got go crazy and buy too many, then it's kind of hard to keep them compact. So I save these when the pa when paintings come in this type. Um, I save them for storage purposes. So, the ones that I have not framed go in here, and they are rolled. I'll just show you quickly because I have already done a video on this. So they are rolled with the drills facing out, and they are rolled loosely. So these are paintings that are waiting for framing. And I write the name of the painting on the envelope. So I have my owl stack, I have my partial peacock, and then I have the rhinestone peacocks left and right, and Dumbo is also in here. So those are the paintings that are in here waiting to be framed. I have some framed ones in here that are going to be gifts, waiting to be gifted. I have my empties, and then I have my paintings that are waiting to be done. Yeah. Oh, no, wait, I'm done. Yeah. Okay, so here are two paintings in here. And there are four paintings in here. So these are completed. So I have three 
that have my completed paintings, and I have framed, let's see, I've framed two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So I've got twelve that I have framed and have scattered throughout the house, thirteen. Um, there's one, Emily's unicorn, we'll count that one. Now, when I look at it like this, I really am annoyed with myself because I really went crazy. I, 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 I don't even know what to say for myself. So, there are 10 in here. Do we really want to do this? There's six in this one, six in this one. There are six in this one. And look here, this one I completed. So what I did was I just drew a line through it. But the other thing that I can do, which is the main reason I'm keeping these envelopes and storing them like this, because take a little bit of rubbing alcohol on a cloth, just put a little bit there, and then all you have to do, it's like a dry erase marker. So there we go. So that's the erase. And I can put another painting in this group and I can write its number right there. So what did I say? We had 12. Yeah, that's six, that's six, that's six. Okay, so we have 18, 28, 36. 41, oh my gosh, 41, that are waiting to be done, plus the six, and what did I say, 11, still coming, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, plus my custom, I didn't buy that though, my mother bought that for me, so I can't, justifying the ridiculousness of this all, Ugh. but anyway, I save tubes. I, I do um, vinyl. So when you buy the small rolls of vinyl, it comes on these, the Cricut brand. Um, I don't know if the Silhouette brand does or not, but I roll them around that. And this one I can actually pull out because they have conformed to their own. I don't really need the stability of the tube anymore. So these are all going to go, and see that one, I rolled a lot tighter because this envelope is smaller, and they were smaller paintings. But some of them, I, I just leave the tubes in there because not that big a deal. And then I have this bin that I just keep them standing up in. That way they don't get crushed, hopefully. But anyway, moving on. I'm so bad, so bad. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this number right here and my Sharpie, and I'm going to write this number, just stab myself in the face, um, on the envelope, D025. I'm just going to quickly write each one on here. See, this one is L eight nine six. I'm gonna leave this one out because get that ready for Emily to work on. Zero one four one. All right. So these these are the paintings that are gonna go in this envelope, and I just stack them up and. Take one of my tubes and just wrap. And these I wrap in towards the canvas. I that's always how they come, so I that's just how I've done it. Plus it keeps the the clear plastic from pulling up. I think it just protects it a whole lot better when it's like this. And then I just slide it 
in here. Like so. And then that will go in there. And now for the container, do the same thing. So as you can see, these are the paintings. And there's that one that I did. I just wrote a line through it because I was being lazy that night. So again, here we go. And you know what? My eyes are not cooperating today, so I'm just going to copy from, because I know these are the same packages. Five and two, six, four, six, two, eight, eight, nine, six, zero, one, four, one. Okay. So that goes in there, and these will go in here, and I'm going to keep out. Like I said, the ones for Emily, for her uniform, I will get that set up for her. Well, she can get it set up herself. She doesn't need help in that department. So these will not go in the box, and they are not, it's not labeled that they are in the box. So there's that, and another, it's full. So moving on to number four. I need to just get faster, get busier, and... And I'm, I am so OCD and ADD, and I've never been diagnosed with ADD, but I'm pretty sure I do have it because I am like a hummingbird. I'm like, ooh, I want to do that. Ooh, I want to do that. Ooh, I want to do that. Oh, I need to do that. Drive myself crazy. Drive myself crazy. So... Like I mentioned, what can we do with these? Somebody needs to come up with something creative for these stinking boats. Now, do I dare? No, I'm not going to do that. I was going to count, see how many, because this will be how many kits I've got. But anyway, I'm not doing that. So there's that. And then what I do with my kits is I open each one, separate it all out little piles and then I put them away because I have a separate I have a whole box just of these pins so I need to um, I need to find a use for the pins and the boats and I'm getting too many of these bags but I really cannot part with them because they are decent piece um, and I had mentioned before that I use those to sort by color my oops my drills that don't have dmc codes i put those those go in the baggies and this one is actually in one of the like the drills come in so they these type of bags i do not save i'm not a fan of these they go right in the trash um, these are the really really flimsy really thin bags so there are six more boats to go into the pile. I'm going to have to get a container for these because now I'm out of room. Hang on. I'll be back. All right. So these are all the pins. And I have attempted to make my own, like, custom drill pins a couple times. So um, there's this is not all that I have gotten. A couple of them have been sacrificed and tossed because I didn't like how the pin, custom pin came out. So those are just the single placer pink pins that come in the kits. And I found this little bin that's... It'll work for now. So I'm going to take the boots. I'll have to find something else. I want something covered because these will get covered in cat hair and <laughs> I think I might need to stop. What do you think? It's been one of those days. My brain's not quite working, and I just realized what time it is. I need to um, get Emily fed. Awana starts back up tonight. I need to get her fed and get out the door and get to Awana before we're late.
little boats are slippery buggers. All right, so see, that's not even enough room. So I have to find something else, but that gets it out of my basket at least. Um, put these in there. Because when I get paintings, I put the drill packs in here. Yeah, I don't know if you noticed when I started the video, that's where they were sitting. So as I get them, the drill packs go in there, the paintings get flattened. And this is my wax collection, along with a couple in here, which is when Emily does her paintings, that's what she uses. And this is my collection. What just went flying? Oh. This is my collection of the bigger bags, which I'm going to have to start a second bag for those because this bag is full. So I just wrap them up. But I need to find something else for these. There's got to be something else I can do with these. There's that. And then these are, I had shown these in a couple of videos. These are awesome. So I went and bought these at Publix in the pharmacy. So they, as you can see, that's what they're labeled. There was a hundred of them and they're the same size as the bags that they send you. This is just bigger here and they're a lot easier to open. Sorry. So these will go in here and I don't even bother trying to straighten them out because they're too hard to straighten out. So this is my drill bag for drills that do not have DNC codes. They go in these bags. All right, guys. Um, I think I'm going to wrap it up. This is my, if you didn't see this video, go watch it. There's a link where you can purchase your very own. Got these. I think I'm going to put these, go ahead and put these in here because I'm getting to the point in my custom see that doesn't fit good. Where I want to do more than one tray of colors, have more than one color out at a time because it's getting a little um, tight in there. See, there's even more wax in here. I've got a ton, 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 ton of wax. Um, what else? What else? What else? I think that's it. I think that be all, y'all. I'm going to sign off, go get the kid fed, take her to Alana, and enjoy two hours of quiet by myself while she's in the water, and get this video uploaded for y'all so you can see it probably tomorrow. But anyway, so there you have it. Thanks so much for watching, and remember, get me to 600 subscribers, and I will give away another painting. So, have a great one. Thanks so much for watching.